Tracker weather starts now with meteorologist Stephen Sullivan. Welcome back on this Wednesday morning. Sun already on the rise out there. Of course, we're dealing with a few uh, different things over the next couple of days. Right now, we're dealing with temperatures around 44 degrees and a wind that's fairly calm at the moment, but we'll pick up later into the afternoon today. Temperatures more broadly across north central Montana, mostly in the 30s and 40s at the moment. Uh, 47 in Great Falls, 45 in Helena. We're at 38 in Cutbank, 43 in Haver, and 48 in Glasgow. And as far as our satellite and radar is concerned, we're dealing with that cloud cover that's been kind Kind of uh, broadening more widely in western Montana, some uh, clearing still in the central and eastern portions of the state, although clouds have gotten into Lewistown and Haver recently. And for your high temperatures today, one more day of those temperatures near 70 degrees for a lot of locations. We're forecast for 70, in fact, in Great Falls, Haver, and Glasgow today, 66 in Hayes, 68 in Lewistown, and 60s. We're still a little bit cooler in the northwestern part of the state for Cutbank. And taking a look at future track, we do see um, that clouds and eventually some shower activity as the first disturbance makes its way through our area as we head into the afternoon today. A little bit of a break from the precip as we head towards tonight and into the early part of tomorrow, as you can see, uh, as we head through uh, your Thursday morning. But you'll start to see another disturbance make its way in from the northwest. And of course, with cold front um, going along with that, we do have temperatures dropping into the 50s and 40s by tomorrow afternoon and by tomorrow evening, even getting down to the 30s in a lot of locations, including lower elevations like Great Falls and Helena, but we're primarily concerned in terms of snowfall forecast for the upper elevations, the Little Belt Mountains as we head through uh, your Thursday night and Friday morning. Chance for some flakes in the lower terrains as well, but again, winter storm watch primarily for those areas above four to 5,000 feet. Uh, with that, that's your best chance for six or more inches of snow, primarily again in the Little Belt Mountains or uh, the uh, upper elevations just east of the Continental Divide. And here is the possible amounts. Could be getting a substantial uh, amount of snow in these areas, but again, lower terrains like Great Falls, Helena, uh, maybe some flakes, maybe a dusting in some of the uh, grassy terrains, but nothing really too substantial. The wind, however, going to be uh, threatening a lot of us over the next couple of days uh, in terms of 40 to 50 mile per hour gusts and the wind tomorrow even more so with gusts to 60 and even maybe a gust to 70 miles per hour in some select locations before things die down a little bit as we head towards your Friday morning forecast. Here are the high wind alerts that are in place in orange and in darker orange to near brown uh, for western and central portions of north central Montana. For your lows tonight, 30s and 40s looking a lot like the current temperatures do now uh, for your Wednesday night and Thursday morning forecast. And then for Thursday, we're not really getting into the uh, really above 50 degrees much except for in eastern Montana. Great Falls and Helena three to seven day forecast does keep us at 50 on Friday as well. And then eventually back into the 60s normal for this time of year as we head into Sunday and the start of next week. And for Helena, your high today 71, 50 tomorrow and 51 on Friday dealing with rain, upper elevation snow showers and wind over the next couple of days.